<laughs> All right, well, fresh pow you shall get. Uh, right now we are looking at here at uh, 5, almost 17. Well, things are quiet here in town. We're starting to see some snow moving in from the west. So you're going to find some wet roads there along I-70, closer to Glenwood Springs, Eagle, toward Grand Junction. At this point, still pretty light. Increasing clouds out west here in town. Low to upper 40s by it looks like midday. Still under a Denver 7 weather action day though here as we track this next storm rolling in. We'll issue it usually in advance so we can get you prepared for what could be an inconvenient drive here, especially early Wednesday morning. 40s for highs today. We're going to be close to 50, not quite as warm as this weekend, but still pretty nice, pretty mild. Take a look at some of these alerts. I'm going to detail these more in a bit, but right now we're looking at a winter storm watch that goes into effect. Tomorrow morning covers all of northeastern Colorado, the entire metro area, winter weather advisories for the mountains, a winter storm warning down to the southwest and through the southern San Juans, some heavier snow there. But right now, 20s, so a fairly quiet start. And statewide, we're going to see some mid to upper 40s in town here and some 50s down to the southeast. Take a look at Futurecast. Now, starting late tonight and early tomorrow morning, we'll have snow out west. We're waking up early tomorrow morning with dry conditions, so your Tuesday morning commute still looks to be pretty good. It'll be the Tuesday afternoon commute, especially south along the Palmer Divide, or for those of you that may come in from the Springs, uh, if you work there and then you head back up north toward Denver, tomorrow afternoon you're going to find some icier conditions down south and over Monument Hill. Then that snow fills in Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. That's likely overnight when we're going to see our heaviest accumulation. So a slick Tuesday evening commute, but by Wednesday morning, we're going to see quite a bit more snowpack. In fact, upwards of around five to 10 inches possible. Things will start to taper off by Wednesday afternoon, and then we'll see skies clearing out. Sunshine returns on Thursday, but we're talking about a good 36 hours uh, with that chance for some snow and some of our snowfall totals anywhere from five to about 10 inches. And some of these numbers could go up if we get a few bands of snow and a little more of an upslope up and through the mountains again, well over a foot in some areas. We're going to see some good snow for the mountains and likely more winter storm warnings out west. So two Denver 7 weather action days, both Tuesday and Wednesday. It obviously gets a lot colder too. We're going to be in the 30s tomorrow, low 30s on Wednesday, and then things will start to warm up a bit toward the end of the week. Chance for a little light snow on Friday, but we are tracking a pretty active Super 7 day there, Micah. And as we get into mid-January, we've already seen some good snow and obviously more to come.